Two important games in the NFC between numbers one and two. This is the NFC West. The Rams had a big comeback against Seattle uh, earlier this year, five weeks ago. And this time, they didn't wait till late. They started early. 13 straight pass plays to get it going. If we only could throw the ball every time we had the snap. Mark Bolger to Isaac Bruce. Mark Bolger to Torrey Holt. Then Bolger. Why is it the Seahawks get beat by the Ram receivers you never heard of? It's never Bruce and Holt. This time it's Kevin Curtis with a touchdown. 7-0 St. Louis. Next Ram possession. Terrell Biera. He levels Torrey Holt. Remember, he was one of the ones who was burned in that comeback, Tom. Holt leaves the game. But the Rams continue to roll. Yeah, and you look at the replay. I, I give Torrey Holt a lot of credit for running into the middle, catching that ball, knowing the safety was going to hit it. This is Steven Jackson, Tom, with a four-yard touchdown run. 14-0 St. Louis against Mike Holmgren, Seahawks. Now, Seattle, man, once they got going, they had, oh, Jerry Rice can't hold on. That was a tough catch. Then Daryl Jackson. These guys, I can anybody catch? Can they catch? Come on, Seahawks! Daryl Jackson goes through his hands. Then Max Strong on fourth and one at the 39. Can't get a first down. Later in the third, it's 20 to nine. Marshall, Marshall, Marshall. But Ken Hamlin falls on the ball for Seattle. And Seahawks in business have to play tempers for Orlando Pace gets ejected for making contact with an official. It was inadvertent, but he kind of he, he grabbed a hold of him, and you just can't do it. You just can't grab the official at all. He was falling right there. He tried to hold himself up. The official went down. Sorry about that, brother. You're going to have to leave. It's 20 to 12. Sean Alexander, big play. Seahawks are in it inside the 20. But Aeneas Williams tracks him down, forces the fumble, and Seattle with another miscue in Ram territory. Then, Marshall, Marshall, Marshall. Down the sidelines, 40 yards. Sets up a field goal, and St. Louis holds Seattle to four field goals. They have tied Seattle atop the division, beating them twice, so they really have the lead, winning 23-12. to Seattle, six times inside the 30, got four field goals. Yeah, and when you think about it, Sean Alexander, outstanding day, 176 yards yeah. on 22 carries. The fumble, the biggest play that he made all day. Receiver's good day, drops in the end zone, can't get the touchdown to seal the deal. Mike Martz got tough this week with the Rams, and they showed it on the field. They had 462 yards.